year I performed the restoration job on my doors, boot lid, drum brakes and arches. Now it's time to sum up the efforts. The boot lid seems to be okay. I've managed to find some small rusty points, so I might say that the boot lid is in a satisfactory condition, which cannot be said about the doors. The rust spread it under my chemical sandwich, and epoxy primer didn't help that much in rust conservation. Corrosion manifested itself on each door, and I had to change the scheme. The only left back door still remained intact regarding corrosion, but foci of corrosion were found here in a specific place. So let's start. This time I had to pay more attention to rust sanding and I had to increase rust converter exposure time. However, after sanding the edges and taking a closer look I realized that the rust doesn't come out of the door's edge pocket. It reappears only on the outer surface because the door's edge pocket is not deformed and it's too tight, so that even a needle couldn't pass through. Everything went well, but only one month later, the rust reappeared once again, but only on the front doors. The back doors were in a good condition. So I had to resend everything and this time I'm gonna use an edge primer instead of a boxy primer. At a very important moment, edge primer must be overcoated by acrylic primer, otherwise edge primer won't stick to overlying base coat. Three months later, the rust was not revealed and I think that this is the perfect working scheme for this moment. The brake calipers have been preserved in a good condition, but I wanted to make both of them monochromatic.
back wheel arch liners was crashed because of my new the back wheel arch liners was crashed because of my new 17 inch rims which require white tires and the other reason is that this type of rims has a high rate offset I don't want to use the wheel spacers because the wheel is already stepping outside the arch liner and with a high outstepping I might encounter with the sandblast effect so I've decided to deform them by using a built-in dryer and a hammer's handle The arch was in a good condition and nothing needed to be done that I can say about the silencer. After 7 years, the outer layer vanished due to corrosion and started making strange annoying noises. The only trouble I encountered was that there was no silencer for my 1.6 engine model. Only 1.2 versions were in stores. That's why I had to buy 1.2 version made in Poland. And the first thing that I've made was covering the segregate with black protective paint for barbecues. Hope it's gonna prolong its life. I had to cut the exhaust pipe and then I had to remove silencer from the exhaust damper. The only one problem was that the fastening was stuck inside damper and I had to unscrew the damper's bolts. The bolts were too rusty and a broken one. In this case the damper didn't fit snugly to the car's body. I was afraid it would deform under the exhaust weight and that may form a pocket which could hold water inside. It's just a matter of time when the rust would spread in this area, so I had to solve the problem by drilling a hole in a broken bolts area, then I had to tap a new thread. This area was covered with epoxy primer, the cavity was treated with the liquid petroleum conservant and the outer side of the car body was covered with bituminous mastic. The bolts were covered with petroleum conservant too. When everything was assembled, the final result looked pretty good. The last part of the exhaust restoration was about the pipes assembling. The old piece of pipe was covered outside with exhaust sealant and the new pipe was covered with the same sealant but inside. The connection area was strengthened with a clamp. Brake discs and brake pads have seen better days. And I've decided to try German parts only because they had a good reviews and the brake discs and frictional surfaces were covered with powder coating. The drum brakes were in a bad shape, there were lots of cracks and the surface lost its shiny view, perhaps due to an unsuitable clear coat which I used last summer. 